everyone. It's time for your daily dose of magic. Only if changing clothes was that easy. A robot magician, now that's a first. <laughs> how do you yeah. do that? I want to quit my job and now learn how to do this. <laughs> Can you hold out your left hand like this? Okay. Wonderful. I'm going to use the Ten of Diamonds, okay. which is almost the opposite of your Ten of Spades. Yes. So I'm going to have you take your right hand, cover the Ten of Diamonds. Okay. Ten of Spades, yeah? What the hell? <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> my mind has blown again. If it already hasn't blown up from this night, it's now blown up by this car. This is so satisfying. Alright guys, got a nice quick one for you. All you need is one playing card and if you squeeze it tight, it disappears and reappears in the other hand. Of course, to do that is clever sleight of hand. I just sneak it in like this. Isn't that pretty damn cool? Especially when you take a magic marker and it melts through the card like butter. Now if I blow, all of a sudden that does nothing. It's just union rules for magicians. And I can move the pen around the card until finally I can pluck it straight back out. And now that has to be worthy of a like and share. Hey, I'm in a car park. Here is how you can make sure your money never gets stolen. First, you need to put a hole in that money, okay? Then you take your security rope and you're gonna thread it through the cash. Now you can see what's gonna happen. It'll make sure that no one can take it because if you hold the end, then you're safe. Unless, of course, the person on the other end is a magician, they may be able to steal it. So don't let a magician hold on to it. But again, you do this, it stays nice, and safe unless I come along and of course I can take it off for a second or put it back on before anybody sees. So all you need is the magic rope and you need the hole in the coin. So if you don't have a hole I'll give you mine and that way you'll never lose your cash again.